We've played them twice now and, and come away um, with two, two wins, one pre-season, one in this, this competition. Um, again, it's difficult to um, see what Bristol will be like with looking in too much depth they're out of the competition. They could be looking to breed some new players or, or chuck the same team back out there. Um, so it's concentrate on ourselves this week and um, we feel if we get our roles, responsibilities and our performance right, the result will take care of itself. And having Danny Wilson, obviously he's got the experience of Bristol. Does that help in any way? Yes, yeah, I'm Matt Jarrett, so it's, um, they're, and Matt. Yeah, they're both from Bristol. Um, they've, they've got new coaches, so it's, it's difficult to kind of say this is how they're going to play. Because, yeah, of course, yeah. Um, yeah, they'll, they'll change their tactics, change change their team possibly. So it's, it's pretty much concentrated in on, on us in this building and going out and performing. It's been a few years since the Blues have been in you know, the knockout stages of the year. Obviously, it's in the Challenge Cup. Mm -hmm. came close last year before you came on board, but that does add something to the season, doesn't it? Because it means you're, you're still competing on a couple of fronts going into April and May. It makes an exciting end to the season. Yeah, definitely, I think. As, um, as a player, you want to be in them big games. Mm -hmm. um, as a club, you want to be winning silverware. So we're giving ourselves a chance to play after this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, but by taking it one game at a time, um, yeah, as a player, you want to be in, in games, I guess it's, it's all or nothing, so um, yeah, win, win on the weekend, it's exciting. What about the kind of the varied role this season, a couple of outings here and there in the centre? Mm -hmm. is, is, that, is that something you enjoy? You talked about the big post centres there, there can be some big 12s out there to play against, but how would you see yourself moving forward positional wise? Still very much a 10? Um, a 10 who can play 12. Um, <laughs> not 12 can play yeah, 10. I'm, not, I'm not sure if, if I go through uh, throughout my whole career, I've, I've played probably more 12 actually, mm. which um, is the first season where I've had a really good stint of 10, which I've enjoyed. Um, my London Irish days, I think I played um, 12, yeah, 35 games out of the 50 at 12. Mm. The first year I came back to the Scarlets, I played a lot outside Reese Priestland. Um, so it's a, it's a role that I'm, I'm happy doing so. Um, I like the kick and duties because I think that's a, a strength of mine. So it's it's getting on the field, um, bringing the best I can uh, I can bring to a team. If the the tactics are playing wider and that's that's what you want to do, mm. I think that's a good role for me um, playing twelve. But so the coaches want us what uh, suits the game plan.